Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Saturday Swatch Fest, which means I'm going to be showing you 10 random polishes from my collection today that I have not shown on my blog or my channel. We're going to look at live application, and we're going to see some pictures, and we're going to have some fun. So, I'm trying out a new camera situation today, and so I'm this is kind of my first experiment with it. And I'm also trying out that it's the same kind of situation for my swatches. So I'm giving you like much closer look at them. So I don't know how it's gonna go. I guess we'll just try it and see how we like it. So anyway, um, yeah, let's just go ahead and get started. So before I forget, the combo that I'm wearing on my lips today is NYC Expert Last Lip Colors. These super inexpensive um, lip colors from NYC. I really think that they're great. And this is in the color Love My Latte. And then I decided to go ahead and use that gold uh, wet and wild color called Sunset Stripped um, that I picked up in my and showed you in my last haul. And I just kind of put it in the middle of the lip. So I wanted to go ahead and give that a try and see if I would actually be able to use a gold lip color. So I thought it worked out okay. So let's go ahead and get started. As usual, I'm gonna start out with red. Today I'm showing you Finger Paints Red Brand. So it's like Rembrandt, but instead they use the word red in there. And this one actually, this one is really gorgeous on the nail. And it's almost a one coater, but it stained my nails. Not my nails, but it, you know how like there's a difference between when it stains your nails? I've talked about this before. And when it gets into the, like the sides of your nails and it will not come out, that's what this one did so when I went ahead and swatched it again for my video portion that you're about to see I made sure to be really careful about when, how I was taking it off so anyway it's just this nice um, very deep red um, like sort of leaning to a berry with tons of shimmer in it so let's go ahead and take a look Alright, for pink, I'm showing you a polish from Revlon that was just kind of sitting in the back of my stash forever. Finally getting out to swatch it. It's called Lilac Pastel. I am thinking that I probably picked this polish up like, you know how, I don't know if that you have grocery outlets near you, but when I where we used to live, we did have one and they have like four packs of Revlon polishes. And this is, I probably picked this up back then. It is not really the greatest formula. It's kind of watery and I mean, you can find other pinks that are in the same shade. So um, definitely a pass for me on this one, but I'm gonna go ahead and show you what it looks like anyway. for orange I'm gonna show you China glaze and this is Roman numeral 5 and it's from the collection where they all had the different Roman numerals this is just like a super brown orange it's like super super warm so it's not very I think it's like a little bit easier to wear I'm not too crazy about wearing orange nail polish all the time I mean I like to have it and collect it because it's fun but I don't choose to wear it all the time but this one is definitely easier to wear so um, it's nice and creamy it was easy to apply let's take a look
All right, for the yellow slash gold category, I'm giving you Maybelline Color Show Bold Gold, and it's from their Metallics collection. It's just, it's kind of like a rich gold. It's not very light. It's definitely on the, like, gold going towards bronze, I think. So anyway, this one's a one-coater, super easy. If you need just a super easy metallic gold and you don't have one, this one is great. So yeah, let's go ahead and take a look. And for green, I'm going to show you Curry Up from Sinful Colors. So the first word is like curry, the delicious food. Oh, I love curry so much. Um, anyway, side note, this is like a lime to kind of mossy, like, like kind of like goo green. <laughs> and then it has tons of micro shimmer in there. So I don't think it's like necessarily a very flattering shade of green, but it's a really interesting color of polish, I think. So let's see how Curry Up swatches in two coats. All right, for blue, I'm showing you OPI Swimsuit Nailed It. And I believe this is from the um, Miss America pageant collection or something like that. Anyway, I'll tell you here what it really is since I'm speaking out of turn. Um, yeah, and it, this is gorgeous. I found this at um, like a Marshalls or TJ Maxx and I never knew how beautiful this color was. This blue is just crazy vibrant. It's beautiful in two coats. Ooh, this one packs a punch. Let's take a look. All right, so my runner up for A plus polish, I could have chose this one or the one I chose. They were really close in a tie, I think, because this one is a one coater, delicious, gorgeous, deep, deep, deep violet. So, so deep on the nail. And this is Color Club Nail Roby. And I actually did review this whole collection back in the very early part of this year, but I guess I didn't like show swatches on my blog or something because I still had it in the bin that needs to be shown swatches of. So we're gonna go ahead and do it today. And we're gonna get that out of the way and it's gonna be done. So I love this one so much, so easy one coat. I'm gonna show you two coats, but you really don't need it. Let's take a look. All right, for the polish in the neutral family, I'm showing you a silver, and it is from Nina Ultra Pro. It's called Shooting Star. This one is just super, super bright um, on the nail. You definitely do need two coats. It has super micro silver glitter, and then it has like slightly larger hex glitters in there, but not so large that they really stand out that much. It, it does kind of make a really good mesh together. 
And I like this one. It's just um, really, really vibrant. Great for, it's gonna be great for the holiday season or any time that you just wanna have a really loud silver nail. So let's see how Shooting Star looks on the nail. All right, for the glitter family, I'm showing you Love Marilyn from China Glaze. And this one um, was from their, what was it, the 3D Glitters collection? I'll tell you for sure. <laughs> I'm not too good at that today, am I? Um, anyway, this is just, it's micro red glitter and then it's larger silver glitter, but not super, super large. This doesn't really get opaque on its own. Um, even in three coats, you can still see the nail bed. So I definitely would use this one as a topper, but it's really pretty. So let's take a look at how Love Marilyn looks on the nail. So for my A plus polish of the week, I'm showing you Sinful Shines I'm Blushing. And this is just a great polish that sits right in that pocket of a creamy, peachy ivory, I would say. And so I really like this one because I often rely on my two favorite um, light neutrals from OPI for nail art and things like that. And now I have another one that I'm gonna use as a go-to because I think this one's really great. And I think it looks nice on the nail, really nice and fresh without having to wear a white nail polish. You can kind of get pretty much the same effect with something like this. So I really enjoyed it. Let's go ahead and take a look. All right guys, so those were all 10 polishes. You know which one is my A plus polish. If you wanna see the rating that I gave the rest of these polishes, I will have that review up on my blog. And if you don't know the address to my blog, you can find all that kind of information in the down bar, as well as the names of all of these polishes in case you missed any. I'm so glad that you stopped by today. Thanks for coming and having some fun with me. I hope that you're having a great weekend. We are about to head out to the beach. So I'm in super fast mode and staying in my casual, attire for traveling in the car and we're gonna go have some fun with the kids in the waves and sand and probably get really messy but oh well that's what the beach is for right so i hope that you enjoyed this video make sure you're subscribed if you're not already and i will see you back next time bye